Alright, hi, welcome back. Okay, today we are going to talk about the three applications of radiation. The first application will be the refrigerator. Okay, and uh, over the re in the refrigerator, we want to look at the back of the refrigerator where the cooling fins are. Now, what are cooling fins? Cooling fins are painted black in the first place, and these fins are placed here to help cool the fridge. They continually draw heat uh, from the fridge, okay, to make the fridge cold, and they release it back to the surroundings. So you expect the back of your refrigerator to be actually very hot and very warm, okay. And please do not even attempt to touch the cooling fins at any point of time, okay. Now, uh, we want to ask then why are they painted black? Okay, now uh, there's a few reasons, okay, and one of the um, the main reason, right, is actually because there's heat transfer going on and this heat transfer is by radiation. Now, we all know that black is a good absorber. The black painted coil is able to therefore gain heat efficiently from the fridge, okay, and this will help cool the fridge, okay. Compared to white surfaces, black is definitely better, okay, and it also must release heat efficiently uh, to prevent overheating, okay. Now, uh, it's going to be hot, okay, and therefore it needs to emit back to the surrounding as fast as it can okay the, the main idea here right is that cooling fin needs to absorb heat and release heat at a very fast rate and good uh, good absorber and good emitter we all know that black surface is capable of doing so now if you are more interested on how uh, the fridge actually works okay you may want to check out this youtube link that i have posted over here and or you may just actually Radiation that 
heat that is going to escape as radiation will be reflected back to the beverage and therefore in that sense heat will be trapped okay so uh, this is a brilliant method okay um, through this we are going to have um, we are going to be able to trap heat for a long time uh, for a hot beverage that we just pour into the vacuum flask okay now the key idea okay is that the vacuum flask doesn't need to heat up okay so you can prevent heat transfer from you can prevent the beverage from getting heat is fine okay it just needs to have the ability to retain the heat of the drink inside it now you just do not want it to be able to release heat at such a fast rate it doesn't need to gain heat but it doesn't but what you want is that it does not release heat at such a fast rate okay so that's the idea of a vacuum class and now we can really enjoy our hot coffee at any point at any time okay so that will be all for this uh Okay, I hope uh, this is slightly more interactive. Okay, uh, remember to subscribe to VGSS Science. Okay, uh, yeah, and please uh, feel free to rewind the video and fill your notes accordingly. Please try the tutorial at the back of uh, the notes. Okay, I'm going to end the video here. So that's all for today. Thank you.